It's been a very positive past couple of weeks here for the Oklahoma Sooners. After a huge spring game weekend where they got a, a bunch of commits from highly ranked guys, including two five-star recommitments in Theo Wees and R.J. Henderson, they continue their momentum in the Dallas area, specifically at Allen High School, where Wees came from with the commitment of Rivals 250 offensive lineman E.J. Nadoma Ogar on Wednesday. Now, he's a big, big commitment for Oklahoma, beefing up that offensive line. Obviously, you look at the way that the offense is run under Lincoln Riley's first season as well, and every offensive player wants to go there. And EJ uh, Nadoma Ogar is going to fit right in with that Sooners offense. Uh, when you look at him, he's a very stout, very fit, powerfully built uh, interior offensive lineman. He plays a little bit of tackle at, off, uh, at Allen High School. I don't think that that's necessarily going to be where he ends up playing at the college level, just because he's a, probably a couple inches too short. But, but really, when you look at him as an interior guy, somebody that has such a powerful uh, lower half of his body can really drive uh, you know guys finish blocks and you know his twitter handle is ihop uh, so you know he loves getting those pancakes somebody who really turns it on and can play uh, with a lot of physicality you know there are times when i think you know he, he doesn't play with quite the level of aggression that you would like to see from uh, some of those guys at, at the highest level but but when he does get angry when he does get mad when he does play motivated he can be a punishing offensive lineman and just a great fit here as the oklahoma sooners continue on with their top ranked recruiting class in the nation